Click to download DMO intensifies enlightenment on federal savings bond. Gaudi Ajin the DMO Debt Management Office, DMO, has intensified efforts to enlighten investors on the benefits of investing in the Federal Government Savings Bond, FSB. The FSB was launched last March to encourage retail investors to invest and enjoy stable and tax-free returns among other benefits. However, the patronage is remains low. But in order to reach out to more retail investors, DMO has intensified the drive to have Nigerians invest in the FSB. Only recently the agency took the enlightenment campaign to traders at Gudu District Market in the Federal Capital Territory, FCT, Abuja. The Director, Portfolio Management Department, DMO, MR. Oladli Afolabi, told the traders at the market that the federal government was committed to promoting a good savings culture amongst Nigerians. That commitment, he said, led to the grassroots campaign to encourage people to invest in the FSB. We are here so that you, traders, can see us and know that what the federal government is offering is real. Government wants you to save and earn good interest on what you save. Saving with your government is the best way to save, a Falabi told the audience. In a presentation, Mrs. Bose Olafisoy of DMO told the traders that the FSB belongs to the people, therefore, the decision of the DMO to engage with ordinary Nigerians on the streets, in the markets as well as churches and mosques. Speaking at the event also, chairman of the Gudu Amalgamated Traders Association, Chief Bond Naimani, urged his members to seize the opportunity offered by the DMO to have additional savings especially one guaranteed by the full faith of the federal government. The Gudu market outing is the first of many other awareness initiatives that the DMO will be undertaking to have Nigerians invest in the savings bond. The federal government issues the savings bond every month in tenors of two and three years with a minimum subscription of N5000. Interest on the savings bond is tax-free. Speaking on how to increase investors' patronage, analysts at FSDH Research had said the DMO and the stockbrokers can organize investors' roadshows in various cities and schools across the country. This will be an avenue to directly engage retail investors on the need for them to hold the bonds in their investment portfolio. The DMO can work with some identified large corporate organizations that have large number of employees to encourage their employees to invest in the bonds on a monthly basis. The DMO can also work with government agencies to encourage civil servants to invest in the bond, the analysts stated.